Hello, and welcome to the Tone Zone. Thanks for joining us again. I'm here to talk to you today about something that I'm very excited about, the Vintage Edition RSX Shocker. This gun's gonna look a lot similar to Scuba Steve's gun, but it has a lot of major differences. First and foremost, you're gonna notice the back bolt area. We cut out every little bit that we could without uh, causing any wobble in the spring clip. There's just dead volume back there. It doesn't affect the way the gun shoots at all. It's just purely aesthetic. Now the next cut that I wanna show you guys is up on the front where the barrel screws in. And um, I'm really excited to finally be able to do this uh, at tribute S cut to the old strange SFT shockers that they made um, back in, I think 2005, 2006 era. It's a really cool thing to do. Uh, we We've kind of messed with it quite a bit and uh, we really think that you're not going to experience any any issues with like barrels bending off or anything like that. I mean, this is a top of the line ultra high end gun so we don't expect you to be a poor enough player to stick it in the dirt and kind of break your barrel off. But if you do, we'll help you out. We'll do everything we can to make your gun working because with these guns also comes a VIP black card warranty. That means you guys send it to us and we fix it the same day and we send it back overnight shipping. You guys have an ironclad warranty with one of the best paintball guns on the market and um, if you're a local person, you can bring these guns in at any point, get them clean, service. Um, ultrasonic cleaned is something that we, we just got an ultrasonic cleaner, so that's something we can do now too. Now, the next cut that we did was on the side of the marker. The cuts on the side of the marker really accentuate the uh, eye covers on the gun and it, it gives it a much more animalistic, uh, aggressive look uh, than the than what I consider the feministic look of the traditional RSX. Now on the top of the marker, you'll notice that we did a flat back styling. Um, it's a slight curve, which gives you an hourglass style look on the top of the gun. And then you'll see up in front of the bolt, like the Scuba Steve gun, we cut out the middle here because having holes in your gun is great. There's actually a lot of extra material there um, that, we, that we decided to take out just for weight purposes. And on the front of the feed deck, you'll notice that we reshaped it and cut some of that aluminum out as well. So those are the major differences that set this marker apart. The Shocker RSX platform is one of the best markers out there for the money. No one can argue with that. They did a fantastic job with removing every little bit of weight that they could from the marker. Now that really shows true in the grip frame. And that's why we never modify the grip frames on the Shocker RSXs. This allows us to maintain a reasonable price point with a fantastic tournament level marker because we can get away with just milling the body here um, because there isn't a lot that can be done with the grip frame. Uh, if you ever take the grips off of the gun, you'll notice that there are multiple speed holes, as we call them, um, to maintain the integrity of the grip frame so you can't bend it and do that kind of stuff, but still lightened as much as possible. With this gun, we want to do something a little bit different. This marker right here is going to retail for $1,500, okay? We're only going to make five of these guns total, and they will be built to order, so they will not all be exactly the same. And uh, there's a couple other cool things about these guns as well. These are a collaboration with GOG Paintball, and um, you'll be able to tell that by looking at the serial number on the bottom of the gun, and it also has our stuff laser engraved on there, proving that it's a legitimate vintage marker and it was assembled and approved by GOG. And we're very thankful that GOG Paintball has condoned our uh, efforts to end the cookie cutter lifestyle and have started to help us uh, build and make these really unique markers. So anybody that wants one, you can go ahead and order it and um, give us certain guidelines and specifications that you want to see in your marker. However, if you want one of these guns, I would highly recommend just purchasing this one because it will be a painstaking wait. It's gonna be probably at least a month before we get the body all milled up. Um, this is our busy season. But uh, with that all in mind, I thank you guys for watching. Please let us know if you like the direction we're going with this more affordable series of markers and uh, limited release um, in the comments below. That lets us know kind of how to direct what we're doing and to keep you guys entertained with more cool paintball stuff. Like and subscribe to our videos. Uh, we'll be doing more and more of these in the future. Uh, the more support we get, the more guns we'll make, and uh, we look forward to seeing you soon.